So we are working on Operation Make a Hole. And I'm hauling my canoe down to the creek, old school style. And we're gonna have a little micro adventure today, me and the kids. So uh, let's get to it. Here's my adventure buddies, right on time. See, I think this will be a good place to launch right off the rocks here. This will work. All right, we got our adventure buddies here. I got Ryan and Pete. Hi. We got the four wheeler. They brought all the gear. I brought the canoe. And we are gonna go down into this little creek right here and start making a hole all the way out to the river. We don't know what it's gonna be. We wanted to go kayak camping tonight, but there's gonna be rain overnight, and there's, and there's gonna be high winds tonight, so we figured maybe not the best night and for the family camp out. And there's geese on the island. Right? Yes, and I had an island picked out that would have worked anyway, but it's full of like 20 pairs of nesting geese, so we figured we'd let them uh, do their thing, not disturb them. Are we ready to load up? Yeah. Let's get to it. This could be, this could be short, that's no problem. Because I like this rock and no one plays on it but me. No one plays on it but you. And this is kind of the best way to get down. Are you coming? Well Where's dog. your chips? Aren't you going to get your chips? Hey, why are there so many little rocks on those big rocks? What is that all about? Mm -hmm. Looks like someone placed them there. Mm -hmm. It's weird. Mm -hmm. Who could have done that? Well, Ryan, what do you think, girl? We are on the little creek right here at the Fairy Garden in the Big Turn. I've never been on this creek this far up. So we're going to start heading that way with chainsaw, cutting everything we need to cut on the way down the creek. Are y'all ready? Yes, and can I have my chips in the back? Well, very demanding, aren't you? Mm -hmm. No! <laughs> Do you think there's gonna be turtles up here? I doubt. Oh uh, yeah, I've seen I don't turtles think in so. creek up this far. Hmm? You have? There's the big cliff. Never seen it from back here on the water. This one. Oh, we forgot our life jacket. So we found a big snapping turtle trying to crawl up the creek. He's trying his best to get up through there. I don't know if y'all can see that in there. He's pretty good size. It's that time of year, I guess, he's trying to get up through. We just went down that little rapid. So back there, we just cut our way through our first log jam. Mm -hmm. And we're heading up here to the big bend. Above me on the left is the swamp. I mm -hmm. uh, got a nice little rapid and some big boulders up ahead. Mm -hmm. And looks like some pretty smooth sailing. Mm -hmm. You ready, Guy? Hold this. Record us going around the corner. What tree is that, Dad? Uh, that's an, an American elm, I believe. Hmm. I like how many roots it has. Yeah, it's pretty, huh? Hey, look, there's another jam. That Big one looks even bigger. Log jam, boys and girls. <laughs> I don't know if we're going to make it through that one. I didn't Any... see that when I was doing my scouting. Uh huh. That's a lot. So the question is, when, where did you scout? I scouted everywhere, but right there, apparently. Yeah. <laughs> I literally did. So coming up ahead is a little more than we may be looking to tackle today. We may have to pull the canoe over that. Uh -huh. You see that log jam up ahead. I was able to get up on the flotsam over there and uh, pull the kids in the boat up to the log, get them out, put the boat over, reload. So just enough hole to get through there but I definitely want to come back and finish that one out. So, onward. Woo That's some slow going, huh? Even though there's a movie called Onward, still onward. Yeah. We're finally making some good time now. Um, I, we forgot our life jackets before, but we just ran up. We're, we're not even off the property yet. <laughs> so we ran up and got our life jackets. Pete did and uh, took the four-wheeler back up, got our life jackets. Now we're heading down. Going by Pete's Rock and Ryan's Rock. Mine is a short Picking up a little steam with this wind blowing us down this river. Sadly, 
mine is the lowest. Really pretty one. through here, huh? Sadly. Yeah. Yours is sadly, yours is the lower one? Uh -huh. Sadly, mine is the lowest. Oh, we're gonna take a dive down. Here's a view of Pete's life jacket. Here we go. Hopefully, we can make it with enough water. Take a little life off the boat, that's all right. We have actually been making pretty good time here lately. Uh, if you see the creek behind us, it's been pretty open. A couple little shoaly scoochies, uh, but we're actually coming through here pretty quick. What do you think, girl? Yeah. You want to hold it? Yeah. All right. Here's the, but here's what we are looking at. Can we get around the left, or is it too shallow? Probably get around the left. Probably left. Here's our view. Not really much to see. Ramming speed ahead. So you don't want that log? Don't want the log? We hit it. Alright, uh, watch that paddle as hard as you can. Oh, there's a pretty corner right here. That's really cool. <gasps> Look at the corner we're seeing. I don't think you can see it that well, but like it looks amazing. There's that struggling as hard as he can. <laughs> <laughs> right yep. We should buy some loogies today. Yeah, we got some pretty cool rocks here. Pretty cool little area with all these neat bluffs. I'm gonna spin you that way. That's awesome. We just came around that one there. Chainsaw. We didn't have to use the chainsaw, did we? Mm -hmm. So we had a couple big log jams back there. Made it through. Looks like I see another one right up ahead. Our problems are not over. Our problems are not over. That's right. So I'm standing up looking. There's where the deer scrapple up the bank. And I've got this thing to deal with now. Man, that's a good one. That's a good one. We'll get over it. I think we can get over it, no problem. All right, we are in the middle of a good one. What do you think, Rye? Good, and I just got my shoe. Oh, you got your shoe dirty? No, that's gonna happen. Pete, how you feeling? Good. Good. So I'm gonna try to get this a little further, and I think I can get them inside of it. But I gotta be careful. Some of these rocks are good. Some of them are just roly poly. That's good, Ryan. Don't move any further. Let me check them all out. I'll put this down and turn it back on in a minute. I hear cracking under my feet. Ha! Woof, we made it. Which way, Pete? You tell me. Well, I guess we'll go right. that way. Try to get around and go that way. How about we just go left? We'll, try, we'll try it. Here, you you document this. Hold the camera nice and steady and kind of pay attention to what we're doing. Big left pole. I know. Can you stop pulling that pole? Well, he's doing nothing. Not yet, Dad. Good teamwork. The way to run the camera Ryan is great. There's a big situation. Yep. It's crazy, huh? Mm-hmm. It's pretty in here, isn't it? We may be getting close to the river now. What do you think, Ry? 50 50. 50 50. <laughs> good, good, good guess. So pretty. Mama. We just came under this guy. I think we just got another couple bends and we'll be at the Hall River. Pretty spot here. We have sun coming through the trees, a pretty canopy, and a pretty booger head. Run the run the camera for me. Talk to it. Tell, hey. tell everybody what we've been doing. Um, we've Turn been... the camera facing you and look at it. We've been. Put it up. Uh... Yeah. We just went through a tree over there, yeah. ducked under it, and um, yeah. All right, we got Ryan paddling. We're sliding through the canopy here. Really pretty. It's 
tough with that wind, didn't it? Mm -hmm. We've almost accomplished our mission. <laughs> so what we got is we got Ryan paddling, right. and when she can't right. steer, Pete just bumps us off the bank <laughs> with his stick. <laughs> Brr -er. All right, keep paddling, girl. Very good. You can see where we've come from, just beautiful. We are having a good afternoon, folks. This has been a tough one. A lot of crawling over, under, through log jams. And even getting off the wall. Getting in and out. We got it all muddied up. Got the chainsaw with us, but it's been a fun afternoon, hasn't it? Uh -huh. But I think, um, I think our adventure is almost halfway over because I don't think we want to go back up. So we may have to give old mama a call and see if she'll come pick us up. Very much. Which way do I go? Left or right? Right forward. Follow that water. Go, we gotta go right. There's way too many log jams back there. Let's go right. Watch where you're going. Yeah, we'll go upstream, get out of here. So we made it to the river, which is over here. And now we're trying to get the boat into the water. Well, that is. Here's Pete making a hole. All right, there she is, right there, guys. All right, no, that's quicksand. We'll get back in the boat, we'll float a little further. We gotta jump in here, get through one more sandbar, then we're uh, home free on the river. When we get to the river, I'm gonna call mom, see what we got for a ride. Jump in there, bud, you just gotta go for it. I don't think we're gonna get a ride. You don't think we're gonna get a ride? No, I think we have the paddle. We made it. We made it to the water. Watch out, it might be deep, right? It isn't that. Okay, it's not deep, good. All right. Here, hold my paddle, girl. What do you think, guys? Was that fun? Yes. Was it worth it? Yes. Was it the coolest thing ever? Not the coolest thing ever, but yes. <laughs> All right, kiddos, y'all ready to push off? Um, I need to get the last part. Next destination, Home. Saxapaha, that way. We got a good wind to sail to Saxbaha. We are ready to go. Ryan, you ready? Yeah. Pete, you ready? Uh, we're going to try this seat arrangement for a minute. We may have to switch that up. Saxbaha is down river. Beautiful day, fun time with the kids. Mama's coming to pick us up down there at the bottom. Let's start paddling. Woohoo! Look out, tree. Hope the wind blows down the river. Probably is. Where are we? Ooh, it's gonna be a lot of work. We got a pretty stiff headwind. Couple bald eagles up there. It's kind of cool. There's been a lot of bald eagles on this river last 10 years or so. When I was growing up, you never saw one, but uh, it's kind of neat to see them again. We're at the first island. Whew. Headwind's, headwind's pretty tough. The sun is fading. The wind is strong. Hey, Dad, you might want to, Dad, and we're Dad. miles from the truck. Shoo wee! Nice. They, they can't see it. They don't see it. All they see is splashes. Whoa, that's a lot of toothy birds. That's cool. Proud of these two booger heads right here. They're doing very good today. That was a tough little expedition. And we're all hungry now. And we're all tired. And we're all looking for a warm shower. No. I want warm bath. Mama's got dinner cooking. I think it's the chicken. Mmm. Some good Asian baked chicken. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at all the birds coming. 
Oh, the cormorant's coming back over. Cormorants. You can hear their wings whistle a little bit. That one sounds like a crow. <laughs> awesome. We have another beautiful sunset on Saxbaha Lake. And how are y'all doing, guys? Miserable out here. Windy, we're hungry, we're out of snacks. But I can see the dock straight ahead. Ryan, hold this and film us coming in. Danger! Dam spillway ahead. Magic canoe porches, no boating beyond this point. Well, we made it, Ryan. How do you feel? Ooh, that's a good explanation. How do you feel? Cold and miserable. <laughs> so we had drugged the canoe out of our house, walked down to the back side of the property, and put it in the little creek. We had the big adventure of exploring our way all the way out to the Hall River, and then paddling down. And whether you're a kid, or just a kid on the inside, you never really forget that magic and wonder of discovering what's around the next bend. <laughs>